In this tutorial, we will learn how to create this object. If you have mechanical profile, then select it and click on new drawing. If you don't have mechanical profile, then click on profile presets and select mechanical profile. Then you can give desired name, click on OK. OK, I want to write the existing mechanical profile. Yes. And click on new drawing in this object at first we'll create this portion now here the width is 48 the length is 90 and thickness is 24 at first we will create this rectangle of 48 by 90 size click on sketch select rectangle command Give first point, take your cursor away, then give the width of 48, press tab, give the length of 90, enter. Zoom it. Then take your cursor inside and take your cursor on this button here, solid extrude. Click on it, take your cursor above, give the height of 24, enter. And next is to create this circle of 32 diameter. Click here and select circle center diameter. Take your cursor on this surface. It will automatically change the plane. Take your cursor on this midpoint. Now here it is not showing midpoint. To make it show the midpoint, right click on this e snap here and select midpoint then take your cursor on this line then click give the diameter of 32 then take your cursor inside this portion click on this button here take your cursor inside depth of 40 is automatically shown if it is not shown you can type 40 and press enter or click there Now we don't need this circle, select it and give E enter to erase it. Just pan it to shift this icon, give UCS icon command, UCS icon, enter and click on this display in corner so it will not come in between our drawings. And next is to create the cylindrical portion. Now your diameter is 56 and 32. We will create two circles. Click here on circle center diameter. Give the center point, give the diameter of 56, enter. Again click on the circle, give the center point, give the diameter of 32, enter. Zoom it. Then here we will need a cut of 6 dimension. Take the line command, click on the center point, take cursor ahead in straight direction and click and escape. Then take the offset command, click on offset, give the gap of 3, enter, select this line, take your cursor on this side, click there. Again select this line, take your cursor on this side and click. Then press escape. To stop the offset command then take your cursor inside this portion and click on this button here on solid extrude take your cursor above give the height of 56 enter zoom minus then to move this object click on move select the object enter then give the base point base point will be the center of this cylinder or end point is also correct Actually, this end point is at the center of the cylinder. Then take it to the midpoint of this line and click. And we don't need this portion. Give E, enter, select all the object, enter. Orbit it. We need to remove this internal portion. For that, at first, we will need to union these two objects. To union, click on solid. Click on union. Select all the object, 
enter then orbit it take your cursor inside this portion here click on this push pull orbit it take your cursor below and click and you can check that this portion has been removed now we don't need this line e enter select this line enter and click on the desired isometric view click on this arrow here it will show the isometric view to give color to this object select complete object click here and select the desired color then press escape that's all thanks for watching we will stop here